Hi everybody, it's Don't Be Billy Boudreaux, aka Russell Gamer, back here on the WTS YouTube channel. Now, I recently just read a uh, quite interesting article from Slam Wrestling. In this article, they conducted an interview with Bobby Lashley. I'd like to read you a few excerpts of this interview, guys. Um, there's, of course, unfinished business in the WWE. There's always some unfinished business somewhere. But I believe there's something to accomplish in WWE, definitely. I'm completely open to going back. I would love to come back and do something big if there was an opportunity presented. I would definitely consider it. While I would do it, if the, if the chance never came my way, then I would be completely content in continuing with what I'm doing at the moment, and that's continuing wrestling and trying to become the best possible fighter that I can be. Now, the link to this interview, guys, will be in the description box. Now, from what I read, you know, this is just my opinion on it. Again, when you guys read it, you guys can either, you know, post up a comment or you can post up a video response on whether, you know, what your thoughts on it are. But um, what I take from this interview is, you know, Bobby Lashley is really content with being an MMA fighter. He definitely is. But if the opportunity was presented for him to go back to the WWE, if an opportunity presented him for to go back to TNA, I don't think he would take that because TNA just really dropped the ball when it comes to using Bobby Lashley. I mean, they had a, you know, a golden opportunity to work with someone who had talent. If they, they just need to work on his mic skills. Bobby Lashley needs to work on his mic skills. He's got good in-ring ability, but he's got to work on those mic skills. That's the only thing that was holding him down, was, you know, his, you know, his inability to verbally express his character. That's what I, that's what I take. But, you know, other than that, you know, TNA, you know, if they had an opportunity for, t for him to go back to TNA, he would not take it. You would not take him because TNA really, really dropped the ball with him. But if the opportunity from the WWE presented himself, then he would definitely consider it. But if he would, you know, if the opportunity opened up and he would go back to the WWE, then he needs to really work on those mic skills. You know, he still has really great in-ring ability. You know, he really knows how to do a spot well. He knows how to execute the moves. He knows how to perform. But the mic skills are the only thing that are thing that's really, really dragging him down. I don't know if you guys agree with that or not, but um, what I am is I'm open up to hearing what you guys have to say on the subject. You know, either you know, leave your thoughts in a comment below or in a video response. Again, all video responses are welcome here on my channel. And don't forget if you if you like what I had to say in this video, please give us a like. Please give me a like on this video. I would really would appreciate it. So, with that being said, I'm Don't Be Billy Boudreaux saying thank you very much for watching.